The devil, the Bible said, he's more subtle, tricky, he's subtle than anything God made. Because God made him wise. But at first he was, you know, one of God's greatest creations in charge of the music in heaven and all. But guess what? He he's the first rebel. He's the rebel of heaven. It took a lot of angels. He wanted to be like God, right? But just like God's telling these people, don't do this in the Bible. Don't mix. When you come into this land, stick with me. Stick with the God, the true God, the one true God. And your life, he will bless you. It's just same with us. Same with our country. Our country's drifting off so far now. We're in big trouble. It's, it's sad because... You know, so many people are deceived. And one of the greatest deceptions the old rats using nowadays, he used to get all these people, all these heathens, and for years to believe in. Every people had an inclination to know because you're made in the image of God, you, you kind of knew there's a God. There has to be something greater than us that made us, right? And most people believe that, all these nations. So nowadays, the, the newest trick to me the devil uses is not for a guy to make a statue and worship that, or worship the sun or the moon, or they worship any, like the Egyptians worship frogs, whatever. They worship the river, the water. But, you know, because even uh, they were always afraid, like if the uh, volcanoes would erupt, they would, you know pray to all that and they throw their children even in fires to they think God's mad at them and they throw their kids and burn them up that's how crazy this thing can be yeah. but anyway the devil nowadays has come up with this new thing it's called atheism believing in no God man is so smart I mean look at him cell phones I don't need God I got Google right? I can ask him everything I can Google up. Google tells me everything. Google ain't God, is he? That's just stuff people put in there. God is so far above our imaginations, the things we're creating. And man has become so smart now, they don't want to believe in God, period. They just say, ah. Then they come up with, the Bible calls it, the end days will be strong delusion. That delusion means like, you're delirious, like you bang your head so hard, you're going, you don't even know who you are. That's how the people are getting. They believe lies of the devil. They think, they, they can't even believe they were created by God. That's sad, isn't it? Yeah. The Bible says, just by what you see, when you go out in this world and see flowers, tree, that you are without excuse, just that testifies of God, the nature, you see, the creation. How in the world could he, you know, a peacock be just come to be by itself? All oh, these beautiful feathers, just birds and insects even, the things they do. You know, just like a fly, you could fly all over, fly upside down. Now we're, we're copying that in the military. They got jets that go up. I ain't seen land on the ceiling yet. <laughs> See, a fly can land on the ceiling. Anyway, back to the rat, the evil guy. But how do you get trapped by the devil? You, know? you drift away, right? You start you believing. Put the, you put the mouse trap like somewhere. Then the mouse shows up. And they don't see they walk on it. Then when they so you put peanut butter on the trap. <laughs> then or when they cheese. walk up and lick it, they will get trapped. Oh, man, you must work for orchids. Yeah. <laughs> Does your dad you work just, for orchids? Or you can you just, just do put cheese on it because mice good. love cheese. Yeah, but the devil <laughs> uses all kinds of cheese, all kinds of bait for us. You know, Pass he don't want us just like these people. Yeah. Those. Yeah. I thought. I thought a mouse on the bed and it was 